my initial reaction when Trent told us that he wanted to join the Corps was not surprise, because it, it, it wasn't a surprise. I sort of expected that, and I was pretty proud right away. I was glad that that was the direction he wanted to go. You know, for years, he always had an interest in military. His room had pictures of, you know, planes or tanks and that sort of thing. So it, it wasn't really a surprise to me at all. And as a kid, he was going to all these games over the years, the Aggie football games, seeing the Aggie band, seeing all the core. Not a surprise at all. I was really pleased. I was glad to hear that he wanted to join the Corps. I was a little concerned at first, especially maybe during his freshman year, uh, on how he would do with his academics. I know that there's a lot of demands, and my perception was there was a lot of activities that were required and on into the night and, or into the evening anyway. But I quickly found out that that must have been just a perception, a wrong perception that I had, that it was really structured. And they had like call to quarters or a study hall, if you will, and it was several hours every night. And so I was glad to hear that because I knew then that he and his buddies would all be studying and working on that. What a great experience, both coming in as a fish and working his way up you know, to a sophomore and immediately you're already learning to be a leader there because you're kind of in charge of the fish. And then as a junior, so each step was a growing step for him. And the responsibilities that he had the opportunity to take advantage of and that, that and he did, he was, you know, trying to uh, be selected as a, you know, one of the officers within his outfit. And then this year, him being selected as a, a CO of, a, of Squadron 3 was super exciting, both to him and to my wife and I. And you could see that that's come through his whole experience of being in the Corps, um, all the training they do. He goes to those meetings, you know, before the semester, after the semester. It's just a lot of that. And then uh, you could see that he was really enjoying and accepting that challenge and that responsibility and it's kind of like what he wanted to do and we could see it so I think there's no doubt that being a member of the Corps of Cadets helped you know give him that leadership skills that he wouldn't have had otherwise.